The Lewis and Clark Bridge, located on State Route 433 between Longview, Washington and Rainier, Oregon, is set to undergo some much needed maintenance in 2023 to extend the life of this very important structure. The work will involve replacing two expansion joints that have served travelers for years and now need attention. These expansion joints, called finger joints, are a vital part of the bridge design as they allow the bridge to safely expand and contract with changing temperatures. Replacing them now will be a short-term inconvenience for travelers while the work is done, but a definite long-term benefit for the life of the bridge. Let's review what you can expect during this important bridge maintenance project. It will take approximately two months to complete the repair. Work will include weeks of nightly single-lane closures and a total closure of the bridge that will last up to six days. The six-day closure will take place in the spring or summer of 2023. We will share the exact schedule and closure dates as soon as possible with the communities on either side of the bridge once we have a contractor on board and know when the work will begin. During the work, you can expect longer delays and congestion whether you are commuting across the bridge or just driving in the project area. The speed limits in the work zone will be reduced for the safety of travelers and the construction crews. And while there will be a full bridge closure for six days to vehicle traffic, it is very important to note that during that closure, pedestrians, bicyclists, and emergency vehicles will be provided access across the bridge. Before and after the six-day full bridge closure, there will also be weeks of overnight lane closures, during which traffic will alternate crossing the bridge using one open lane. Travelers should expect delays and extended travel times during weekday and weekend evenings, overnight and early morning hours. Three detour options will be available during the closures. One will cross you on the Interstate 5 bridge in Vancouver, the second will cross you at the Astoria Megler Bridge, and the third uses the Wakayakum County Ferry between Kathlamet and Westport. During the full bridge closure, the Wakayakum County Ferry will run twice an hour, 24 hours a day. This is a small capacity ferry that should only be used by those who have critical need to cross the river. We ask that those who do not have an urgent need to cross the river delay their trips or plan for long delays and wait times. WashDOT is acutely aware that this type of project is a genuine inconvenience to the traveling public. And while we wish it could be otherwise, our responsibility to the travelers on our highways is to keep our vital bridges open and in good repair for use. The good news is, this project has been planned well ahead of time to allow communities on both sides of the bridge ample time to plan alternate routes or to delay trips. This preservation work will extend the useful life of this structure, maintaining its integrity, keeping it safe and open to use for years to come. In the months ahead of the work, WashDOT will be working closely with emergency responders and medical providers throughout Washington and Oregon communities to best prepare for the full closure. Use the QR code on your screen or use the website in the video description and sign up for updates so you will have all the latest information available to make your best travel planning decisions. Thanks for watching and please drive safe.